How's it going everybody? So in this video, I'm going to talk about our zero calorie drinks, really zero calories. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. Okay, so are they zero calories? You have a diet Pepsi or a diet Coke. You got a Coca-Cola Zero. Are they actually zero calories? 110% yes, they are zero calories. You guys have to understand that nutrition info, like any nutrition info that you see, that's regulated by the government. So it's, it's, it's big, like it's, it's serious. You're not gonna have people putting false information on packages. Here's the thing though, the, the, the information on nutritional packages can be off by about 10 to 20% and still be allowed. So that's a little, that's a little stupid in my opinion, but it, I, again, they're not gonna be perfect. But again, it is regulated by the government. So you need, so those, when it says zero calories, it's zero calories, you guys. Um, if you're looking at something else and maybe it's like spaghetti and it says 100 calories, it may be like 110 or 120 or even 90 calories. But usually the drinks that are zero calories, they're zero calories. Um, there's just no calories in them. Um, one thing that they do have, most zero calories have um, aspartame. Um, this is really, really bad for you. It's similar to formaldehyde. So it's not really that good. Um, in my opinion though, having a Diet Coke is better than having an actual Coke that has 40 grams of sugar because it, you're basically drinking sugar. So in my opinion, a Diet Coke is better than a regular Coke, but the difference isn't that big. But yes, yeah, zero calorie drinks, they're 100% zero calorie. That's what I do when I'm cutting weight. When I'm cutting weight and I wanna have um, a drink of some sort, I will have a Diet Coke because there's no calories in it and I can have one or two and it won't affect my calorie count at all. So that's something that's really, really, really good. I, I really like doing that. Um, but again, anytime you're seeing these, these nutritional information on the back, um, they are correct. No one's gonna, no one's gonna be like, here's a, here's a protein bar and it's actually 500 calories instead of hundred. No one's gonna, no one can mess around with that nutrition info. Again, it has to be correct up to about 10 to 20%. So just keep that in mind. End of video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999. Thank you.